what are my general options to improve the user experience for my users? Let's start with the users, and in fact, you should always start with the users. It seems they are not very satisfied with their current user experience. So of course, our target is to increase their satisfaction. In a later video, we will talk more about user satisfaction, how this could be measured and how user satisfaction has an impact to my costs. By the way, impact is a good term to start with. What I need is some impact that improves the satisfaction. Like always, impact means I need to invest something. It might be just my own time, or it might be soon or later the time of a whole team. So let's add investment to this diagram. The first option I have is to adopt things coming from SAP. These might be even for free as part of my existing license or with just some additional license. The good thing is that whatever I'm going to adopt, it is supported by SAP. After all, the investment will be, in comparison to the potential impact, quite small. What's the impact? Well, more users are happy. The second option to make more users happy is to adapt the pieces I have adopted before from SAP and I can adapt them to specific needs of my users or groups of users. SAP offers a couple of adaptation tools that can be used to easily tweak user interfaces and with that improve the whole user experience. Interesting is that many people start talking about the third option before considering the first and the second. The third option is to develop own user interfaces or let's say even own applications. This obviously requires the highest investment. It is not only that you have to develop the user interface. Of course, you have ideally spent some time up front to design what you develop. And after your development phase, you have to take care on supporting it for the rest of its lifetime. However, there are sure reasons to develop things. If there is simply no solution for your specific problem uh, and you have a lot of users that can be satisfied at the same time with your development, you already have important parameters that drive a business case for an own development. Phew, that's already a lot of stuff, but it makes one point pretty clear. It is a good idea to think about your own UX strategy that defines where you want to be and how you want to achieve it. This might be a good time to guide you to a place that provides more information. Just go to sap.com slash UX Explorer to learn more about your options. And stay tuned for the next upcoming videos. If you like this video, let us know and rate or comment it in YouTube. Thank you and goodbye.